Okay, I got some olives for some salads. Um, I do like the Kalamata olives and I wasn't even thinking I should have got some of those because I think I'm running low. Um, I also picked up some cucumbers. The mini cucumbers in the bag didn't look too great, like they had liquid in them. And then also, I meant to, if you hear trail in the background, here on the phone. And also, I forgot to get a bag. So I'm gonna have to wash these off. Of course, I'm gonna wash them off really good because I was like, hope oh, I forgot to get a bag like two times. I was looking and meant to get a bag. Okay, so I got my pineapple spears. They look okay, they might be fine, but that's why I went ahead and got a pineapple because that was the last one. I love this medium fresh salsa. I wish they had it in a spicy, but they only have it in mild and medium and I love it. I got some lemon, sometimes I make lemon water and then if I don't get around to making lemon water, I put it in the garbage disposal to make it smell great because it was smelling the other day for some, usually just for lemon water is usually what I use it for. The almonds, almond water, I'm sorry, almond milk. I got the unsweetened. We already have like fruit, frozen fruit. I just have to find it in the freezer. I know we already have some. I wanted to get some of this sparkling frost pink grapefruit and orange mango. I haven't gotten this in a while. Okay, so um, these are 75 cents a pound. So that's why I picked up these. I got some of the cherubs tomatoes and some raspberries usually they're raspberries these look pretty good but sometimes when i get them they go bad um really quickly the kabucha this was the last one the cashier was saying how he loves the pink lady apple and i was like i do too i got some of this um sweet kale chopped salad kit and then i got two of the organic baby spinach and some bananas i got four waters purified uh, the gallon waters, yeah, gallon, they're in the car, no, three. Trying to replenish when Cottrell had the Rona, replenish, replenish that water, then hurricane season is about to start back up. So I want to um, stock up on that water and have two cases of water, I think 24 packs in the car. Thanks so much for watching y'all. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the very next video. Bye-bye. Hi guys, so I went to Aldi today. Today is Friday, June the 25th, because I have not been recording or uploading. I should say uploading consistently. Um, and I have some other videos to, to put up. So I just picked up just a few things today. Not a whole lot today. It's Friday. That's the main reason why I went in the store, because it's pizza day. And they absolutely love pizza in the house. They actually said that, you know, Walmart has like the take and bake as well or something like this in these boxes. I set some stuff on top of it, y'all. That's why it looks like that. And um, JJ said, <laughs> I think JJ's going to be like a food um, critic or a connoisseur. I don't know. He can tell like which ice cream is better and whose brand and um, this one don't have enough cookies in it, like cookies and cream or the pizza. He don't like Walmart's box pizza, but he said that the um, the box frozen pizza, but he said Aldi's is the best. And I agree, Aldi's is the best, Mama Cozy's, then Walmart's. And we used to get Walmart's first because it was, we just realized it was more affordable than going to like Pizza Hut or Domino's and stuff like that on Friday night. So anyway, I got one of the pepper... What is this? Mega meat, the large one and the take and bake. And then I got a medium because sometimes they may just have bottomless pits. Trail may decide to eat. He may not. Who knows? Um, so I got those. I also got, sorry, I haven't got these in a long time. The peanut butter, uh, mini peanut butter crackers. So he wanted to be really finicky last night. Usually when I cook like you know, regular cooking and not just like tacos or pizza or burgers or something like that. He wants to be really finicky, y'all. He don't want to eat his food. I don't know. He, So I didn't want to give in. So a lot of times I end up giving in because I don't want Sia to go to bed sleepy. Not sleepy, Um, go to bed hungry. I gave him some yogurt and some crackers or something. And I just thought about it. I was going past the day and I felt bad because, you know, I like to feed my kids and of course you should of course you should feed your kids but i just like to see them eat 
And um, I just can't wait he gets out of that stage. JJ was in that stage. And now JJ just eats everything. He ready to eat all the time. So anyway, I haven't gotten these in a while because these are like $2 and you don't get much in there. But, well, for $2.29. I got the Benny Bear Grams. They're like the Teddy Grams. I haven't gotten these in a while either. And I think he likes those. Um, I got some pineapple, even though I just got a pineapple from Walmart yesterday. But I like to have both. Okay, I got some mozzarella cheese because I'm going to make my own pizza. I'm not going to eat their pizza. I'm going to make it on my little low-carb um, tortillas. I did do the keto-like pizza, but um, with cheese, and it was so good. It actually filled you up. I posted, like, on my community tab and Instagram and Facebook. Um, but the only thing about keto that worries me is all the saturated fat if you're not if you're not doing strictly keto that's that's what bothers me with that and um so anyway so that's why i like to just stick with low carb or something like that and yeah so um then i did some i got some baby whole deal kosher deal pickles i love this sauce of the medium i wish they had hot i did see they had a larger on um, special buy a larger one but i don't go through it that fast i'm usually the only one that likes it um i probably need to make my own salsa i got some kalamala kalamata pitted olives i love these on salad they are a little salty but i love them and restaurant style tortillas i probably should have got several bags because I did have a little stockpile of uh, tortilla chips, and we don't have any except a few that we already opened from Sam's, the big bread box. I got some honey wheat bread. There probably is some in the freezer. Some purified water. Every time I go in there, because hurricane season, I think, has officially started now, I'll go ahead and, repl and replenish the uh, water that Trail was drinking when he had the Rona, so he didn't really... As for ice or anything, he will just drink it straight out of the jug. So, I just get a little bit at a time, and it adds up quick if you get, like, two when you go in the store. I also got two cases of the 24-pack um, of water. I hate picking up the, the water, but um, if I get just one or two at a time, I get them from Aldi. It's not as heavy as that big one from Sam's. Okay, so, um, I got Jason. Today is his... And Rebby, his last day, he's always excited on the last day he's off. And I got him some cookies, and he loves Aldi's better than, I think, I don't know if Aldi, I'm trying to think Walmart. No, he doesn't. I will get Walmart's, Walmart brand. But I think he said Dollar Tree is the best, and then Aldi, or either Aldi or Dollar Tree. Both of them are good, y'all. Okay, so then I got the um, Health Aid Kabucha Pink Lady Apple. And I'm actually probably may hide these. And if he asks for them, then I'll pull them out. Something like that. I like this um, Pink Lady Kabucha. It's kind of pricey. It's $2.95, but I like it. And that's it, y'all. That was my little haul for today. I did see a little splash pad uh, for Saya. But I see a larger one next week for Saya. Um, I seen some of my neighbors put the pools in the driveway even though ours is most driveways are at a slight slant but if they put it at the top near the garage that may work because sometimes when you put them o over the grass the grass of course is rough sometimes but over the grass it it kills the grass and you got to worry about all that so i was looking at this one for next week so we'll see um something for him to do all right y'all let y'all go okay bye Hi, hopefuls. I'm going to do a really quick video um, after the gym today. Tristan and I went over to Aldi. I have been wanting a steak for over a week because I was going to get one on our anniversary. And then I was going to um, Mama. We went somewhere. Where did we go? To Home Goods or something. And I was thinking about going to Lone Star because we went to Olive Garden and said to Lone Star on our anniversary. But anyway, I said, I'm just going to. I've been eyeing these steaks for a while, and I'm just going to get these and throw them on the grill. So, I only got two. Um, I've been eyeing them on Instacart, and they're like $11 on Instacart. So, they only had the ribeye or are cheaper than the New York Strip. They're $14, I think, New York Strip. And so, these were the only ones that they have. So, these will be for Jason and I 
and this is the weekly buy of uh, the beef strip organic this was cheaper than getting the um thomas farms grass-fed uh strip steak yeah new york strip it was cheaper so i got two of those um i think this was 11 and this one was nine if i'm not mistaken no it was 11 too okay so i got some drumsticks i'm gonna throw these on the grill for them uh they're 541 i got two of these pepperoni pieces i just like to have them on hand i did go to aldi the other day and i picked up i think they already ate them i got some moo tubes for sasa because i haven't picked up any in a while some low carb tortillas i told them not to touch my tortillas and trail came down here ate the last bit actually i like the hard bold and spicy um hard shell now and it's less yeah hard shell now and then trail anyway you can make breakfast burritos out of this and he came down here eating them when i was still asleep um leftovers okay y'all so then i got some pork sausage i might make them some dirty rice i may still have some in the freezer but i just grabbed some some red grapes i had to get the organic because they didn't have any in the regular because that's this is one of the main reasons why i went in there i got some zucchini i'm going to cut this up really quickly and put it on the grill some Asian stir fry for another day and throw some chicken with it. Some bologna, I've been wanting some bologna. I remembered when I was over there looking. And <laughs> I'm gonna fry this one day, fry it up in a pan or something like that, motor bologna sandwich. Um, let's see, some waffles. I only got one. Why did I only get one? Cause I think I have some more. Um, let's see, I got some chicken egg rolls. I like their chicken egg rolls. Um, they are good. Jason got some cinnamon raisin granola. He's been making this mixed concoction for himself. I got some carrots. I got some fit and active chocolate fudge, low fat ice cream bars, and then the wild berry sorbet, sorbet um, bars. I'm gonna put these in the freezer. Okay, I got three things of eggs. They were 79 cents a piece. And then I got some Caesar dressing. Um, two things of ranch because our dressings have or ranch dressing has dwindled all the way down in the stockpile um, some black raspberry they've been drinking my ice so this is Aldi's brand pure aqua the sparkling frost black raspberry Justin what you do with that um, water it's over here it's okay I get it um, the cherry limeade the pink um grapefruit um jason picked these up he was trying to replenish my ice that he was drinking as soon as i put them in the refrigerator they started drinking them so he didn't know that these these are good or this one's good so he only got one um the classic lemonade the marshmallows and stars oh okay i was gonna come in there um i wanted some orange juice the other day but i know orange juice has like um a lot of sugar in it so i didn't realize that they had a 50 count fit and active no pulp orange juice of course you can look at it and tell <laughs> it's like 50 calories and then i got a regular so i kind of have to hide this in the refrigerator because usually i pick up two of these because they'll just drink it like no business um jason's also going to use this for his little mix this honey nut cheerios he picked up two of these and i got two of the fruit rounds and some baked potatoes and here is his little concoction so he's been filling this back up now when i got the trail mix from aldi seemed like the trail mix he's been kind of making his own mix isn't quite as good as how he made it um i think he picked up like several different things from food line or whatever so using this like as a snack um yeah i think he got like his own recipe pieces um this has more nuts in it he had more like a couple of pecans sunflowers um seeds a few m ms he did pick up a bag of trail mix but it was like i don't know it just like a lot of different nuts in it and just taste different it's probably what's missing is the granola because i like the granola in it but anyway y'all that is all oh i almost forgot he brought it over here so i have not tried this he picked this up this is the pure aqua fruit variety pack 
Um, you get 24 of these. You get um, six strawberry, six grapes, six raspberry, and peach. So I can't wait to try that to see if it's good. I know sometimes I see it at Sam's. Is it Nestle? And I haven't picked it up. I'll ask the kids and they'll say, mm. So anyway, y'all, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. Bye. Okay, y'all, so I'm gonna add this to the other haul. This is just a few things from Aldi today. And I wanted to go to get the fans and these bath mats. So I don't, I probably, I haven't purchased any bath mats in a while. And the first ones, I'm surprised how long it took me to buy new ones for our bathroom. I think the boys don't have any because you know how when you have kids, they're just going to have to put like the bath mat towel down. Y'all, I don't know what they be doing in their bathroom, but uh, Josiah uses our bathroom. And downstairs, I don't even worry about a bath mat around the toilet because when you got boys, you're just going to have to wait till they all gone. So anyway, y'all, um, I saw this last night, the memory foam bath mats. Um, they have them too in like a shaggy. I couldn't debate if I wanted shaggy last night, shaggy or this um, smooth um, pattern or texture. I didn't know if I wanted this one. So when I saw it in person, I was like, I wanted this one. Of course, when I got there, because I totally forgot about it, I wanted the runner. So this is the small one, which is, it's not small, small, y'all. It's a 20 by 34. And I wanted the runner, but when I laid out the runner, they were all gone of this color and style. So when I laid out the runner, it didn't look like it was going to meet to my side of the sink to Jason's side. So I was like, you know what? I just get two of these. They were $9.99. The runners were $14.99. So, and I got four of them. So one on each sink and then one right in the middle, kind of where we both kind of get out of the shower and then one in front of the tub. Um, I think it's a little bit too long to fit right in front of the shower. So I'm just going to have to put something there or figure that out. Okay, y'all, so I got this family splash pad. Last week they had one, but it looked a little babyish, so I didn't get it. Audi has been coming out with a lot of different pools and um, little things for kids to do, and I always pass and say, well, no, I want to take them to the water park, or no, we can just go to the pool. But sometimes you uh, just, you know, just want to open this up and let them play or, you know, put the water in and let them play outside. Um, really quickly. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to get this splash pad. This is the family splash pad. It was $8.99. I don't remember if it was $8.99 last week. They had two different styles um, with this one and the one they had last week. They had a stomp and play. They have another pool that's like $59. Um, but we don't have a whole lot of yard space. And I don't want it to mess up the grass, even though it's not that important. But, you know, stuff falls in it. Then you got to figure out you're going to throw this pool away and all that stuff. So I should have got Josiah one of those rubber, hard plastic rubber pulls, but they were grabbing them so fast. And that day I went in there, the, um, what was it? I, I had my car. There was no way it was going to fit in my car. So my next car, naming it and claiming it, my next car, I know exactly which car I want now. I, I have to have like, kind of like a sidekick because I take stuff with me and going to the grocery store and all of that. Okay, anyway, y'all, I know y'all don't care, but. Okay, so I got three in this three-in-one fan and mama was showing me on Amazon the, let's see, let's see, the court, you know, was it, I think it was a chargeable fan. So this is a good prep to add to your stuff just in case like, of course, if you go to an amusement park or something like that and it's hot, you're waiting in line somewhere, you can throw this in your pocketbook. Oh, the batteries are included. So these are $5.99 and I can't remember how much mama said hers were. Hers is a chargeable one and um, hers is really nice. I saw hers, it was really slim line and compact. I'll see if I get the link from her and um, put it down below. But I was looking on Amazon when she said that for battery ones, and the ones I was looking at was like 9 to $12, but I was going to get it. But I saw that Audi was having these three-in-one fans. They come in green. They come in red. So they have the blue and the gray. I wanted to get one for everybody, but my total was adding up getting those rugs and yeah. And then I don't know if they're the best and you just hate to get all 
five or all four, you know, and they're no good. So I'm gonna make spaghetti, guys, today. I got some Texas toast. Um, I haven't picked this up in a while and some hot sausage. I already have some turkey. I'm gonna go ahead and take that out and some sour cream and potato chips. I don't, I got some the other day and it almost tastes a little burnt or whatever, but that's it, y'all. Oh no, I got three gallons of the purified water. It's in the car. I gotta go tell JJ to go get it. And two cases of the uh, let's see, 24 pack of water. So every time I go to the store, I try to pick up some water. So we'll have some, and these kids keep drinking the water. I had to get on them, well, I heard it was Southside. He was talking about, I want a fresh water. And I was like, boy, you have to drink the water that you had, that water's still fresh. So anyway, y'all, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the very next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>